Devri Hayamim Shani, 2 Chronicles 5. Thus all the work that Shalomah made for the house of Yahuwah was finished. And Shalomah brought in eth all the things that David his father had dedicated, and eth the silver, and eth the gold, and eth all the instruments, put he among the treasures of the house of Elohim. Then Shalomah assembled eth the elders of Yashadel, and eth all the heads of the tribes, the chief of the fathers of the children of Yashadel unto Yerushalayim, to bring up at the Ark of the Covenant of Yahweh, out of the city of David, which is Sion. Therefore all the men of Yashadael assembled themselves unto the king in the feast, which was in the seventh month. And all the elders of Yashadael came, and the Leviim took up at the Ark, and they brought up at the ark, and at the tabernacle of the assembly, and at all the holy vessels that were in the tabernacle. These did the priests and the Leviim bring up. Also King Shalomah, and all the assembly of Yashar'el, that were assembled unto him before the ark. Sacrificed sheep and oxen, which could not be told nor numbered for multitude. And the priests brought in at the Ark of the Covenant of Yahweh unto his place, to the oracle of the house, into the most holy place, even under the wings of the Keravim. For the Keravim spread forth their wings over the place of the Ark, and the Keravim covered the ark and the staves thereof about. And they drew out the staves of the ark, that the end of the sta rather ends of the staves were seen from the ark before the oracle. But they were not seen without. And there it is unto this day. There was nothing in the ark save the two sapphires which Moshe put therein at Chorev, when Yahuwah cut a covenant with the children of Yashadael, when they came out of Mitzrayim. And it came to pass, when the priests were come out of the holy place, for all the priests that were present were sanctified, and did not then wait by course. Also the Leviim, which were the singers, all of them of Echaf, of Haman, of Yelethon, with their sons and their brethren, being arrayed in white linen, having cymbals and psalteries and harps, stood at the east end of the altar, and with them a hundred and twenty priests, sounding with trumpets. It came even to pass, as the trumpeters and singers were as one, to make one sound to be heard in praising and thanking Yahuwah. And when they lifted up their voice with the trumpets and cymbals and instruments of music and praised Yahuwah, saying, For he is good, for his mercy endures forever, that then the house was filled with a cloud, even the house of Yahuwah. So that the priests could not stand to minister by reason of the cloud. For the glory of Yahweh had filled at the house of Elohim.